the amazing Randall. What's up, Rascals? Welcome back to Ocarina of Time, and we are finally going up the mountain. Yes! We're gonna go traveling Death Mountain. We're gonna avoid some fallen rocks by ducking under our shield like we're a turtle. And we're gonna... Ooh! Yay! Those things! The name escapes me at the moment, but I'll remember it. Tektites! That's right. Oh, you classic bitches. I actually, at one point, wanted to build, like, a... a monster movie prop version of a Tektite from this game. Because, you know, as a kid, play, playing this, having the imagination that I did, I, I wanted to live this kind of adventure in real life and and you know fight creatures like this I don't know it was it was a weird weird idea I had and I don't oh dear no you don't you you bet you were aiming for me what an asshole all right wait I don't need to go up Death Mountain just yet. I just need to go to Goron City. I didn't need to get this shield just yet. I did it. Whatever. It's cool. <coughs> Give me some ropes. It's the least you can do. Ah, screw it. I've wasted enough time. Let's go meet Darunia. That, that big old meathead is in a funk, and we gotta we gotta get him all excited for life. Hello! Oh, I'm so hungry. Everyone feels faint from hunger because of the food shortage in this town. We're in danger of extinction. It's all because we can't enter our quarry. The Dodongo's Cavern. We Gorons live on a diet of rocks. And the most delicious rocks and nutritious rocks around are found in the Dodongo's Cavern. But that seems like ancient history now. We've become such gourmets that we can't stand to eat rocks from anywhere else. Because we're little bitches. Even facing starvation, we won't do our basic survival instinct I wanted to eat the I want to eat the top sirloin rocks from the Dongo's cavern sirloin I young lady I don't think you understand what sirloin actually means what are we gonna do about you I can't grab it. Oh, oh dear, oh dear. Ah! You trying to run me over? Ah, I ran me over. Okay. I think I need to go down here anyway. Because isn't Darunia... Yeah. And then I play Zelda's Lullaby to get in. And yay. Because he only wants to speak to a messenger from the royal family. He's a grumpy Gus right now. And we're gonna cheer him up. That's right. Hi, buddy. Guess what? Music time. Oh, fuck. I literally just had a brain fart on how sorry a song goes. How stupid. Wow. That... I... And I did it again! <laughs> wow. There we go. That's what you need to hear. My good friend. My rock-biting buddy. Yes. 
You big bearded bitch with the rock biting. Whatever's. Oh, look at him go. He's dancing a jig. He's all happy. He's kind of freaking me out. Oh! 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 Come on! Come on, come on, come on! Hot! What a hot beat! Whoa! Yeah! Yahoo! That voice is gonna kill me. Thankfully, he doesn't have many speaking lines in this entire series. Hey! What an ice tone! Just like that, my depression is all gone. Something just came over me. I suddenly wanted to dance like crazy! I am Darunia. I'm the big boss of the Gorons. Was there something you wanted to ask me about? What? You want the spiritual stone of fire, too? The spiritual stone of fire, also known as the Goron's Ruby, is our race's hidden treasure. And if you want it, you're gonna have to sit through my exposition of history. But hold on, I'm not going to give it to you that easily. If you want it so badly, why don't you go destroy the monsters inside the Dongo's cavern and prove you're a real man? That way, everybody will be happy again. If you do it, I'll give you anything you want. Even the spiritual stone. All of a sudden, I'm developing some weird lisp. What the hell's going on with me? I have something for you. I'm not really giving you this in return for anything, but take it anyway. If you wear this, even a little fella like you can pick up a bomb flower using A. Why did I tell you to use A? I have no idea what that means. All right, bitch, off you go. You got a fancy charm bracelet. You're ready to rock. Ha <laughs> ha! Now then. Shall we mosey? I think we shall. Wasn't there a reason for, you know, grabbing you and chucking you into that thingy? Uh-oh. No, I want to chuck you into that thingy. So, I gotta hurry up and, uh... Okay, because this thing has a very short fuse. And... Damn it. I missed. Poopy. I'm getting sidetracked again, I know, but... I'm sure there is a reason for this. Come on! Damn it! Fine! Whatever! I tried! And now we go to the Dongo's Cavern. But first, we gotta blow up a hole! Alright! What's up, dude? No, you can just go ahead and sit there. Do your thing. Yes? Right in the kisser. Got it! First try, baby! Yeah! Alright! And away we go. Pook! Oh dear! Give me them roops! That's a lot of roops! I got all but one, I think. I'm cool with that. I can live with that. In we go! Into the Dongo's Cavern? Yes, Palias. Grab that bitch. Chuck that bitch. Don't look at explosions. I looked. <laughs> All right. Now then. Ladies and gentlemen, we are about to enter Dodongo's Cavern. Yay! Dungeon! All right, now. Oh, God damn it. It looks like there are many lava pits around here, so watch your step. Thanks, Mom! I'm already aware of the shit that we have to go through 
in order to not get zapped. Oh, oh, oh shit. Ow, 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 ow. I burned my footsies. <laughs> no. In all my years in Hyrule, I have yet to ever come across a cobbler. How am I going to fix my shoes? I don't know. Give me this. Throw this at your bitch ass. Because I don't need anyone zapping me with golden eye lasers. Yay. Now, other bomb. Another door bomb thingy. Go ahead. Blow up. Do it. Yeah. Is there another place that needs to be blown up while I'm here? Maybe... You? Yeah. Yeah. Let's go for it. Hmm? May as well. I mean, it's gotta be done eventually. So, chop chop. Oh, look at you. A ladder. That would have been handy. Oh, it's just a... It's just a gossip stone. Alright, whatever. Oh, why did I come down here? I didn't need to. That was dumb. That was pointless. That was... Just me being clumsy. But, anyway, on we go, in to the tunnels, into the caves, into adventure, where we fight big-ass lizards and such. And little cutesy lizards, honestly. You're cute if you weren't so, you know, deadly. And aggressive, you know. There are some, there are some animals you just can't. Uh oh. Oh, I hear a gold skull fella. Yay! That thing tried to circle around me while I was slicing and hacking. What an ass! Ooh, ooh! What an idea! Come on, come on back here. And now I get out of the way. Ha ha ha! Genius! You're a genius, my friend! Genius! Um. There's a keys in here. I know it. I hear it. Where's the keys? I don't know. But I know where a gold Skulltulla is. And I know it's going to be dead. Oh. I see you now. Is there one on the other side of him somewhere? Whatever. Oh, there you are. Hi, buddy. Another one? Were you guys humping? How am I gonna... I want! No, that's not gonna do me any good. There we go! Ha ha! And even a victory pose for finally getting it. Because I couldn't jump. I don't know. Alright, that took a little longer than I expected, but I got it done. Oh, and you're back. Oh, how cute. I'm gonna go ahead and and smack him. Smack him, you. Smack him, you. You go ahead and kaboom. Kaboom. Have your little shockwave. It's so cute, but, you know, it's kind of just irritating at this point. All right, now, Dan, you, I'm gonna grab you by the sword. That doesn't sound quite right, but you know what? It's just a statue. Don't read too much into it. Yeah. Let's go. Next phase. Oh, you think you're so slick, how do you? Yeah. 
Yeah. It's amazing what you can do with a slingshot and a proper aim, you know? But anyway, we're gonna have to continue this one in another episode. Thank you so much for watching this one. If you liked it, let me know by giving that like button a bop. Leave some comments down below, and I will see you in the next video. Hopefully, it'll amaze. Thank <laughs> you.